<laughs> How would I explain the Phantom to someone who hasn't seen it before? Take your best musical, take your best horror film, take your best comedy, and take your best love story, roll them into one, and double it. Hey baby, this is Will Van Zack here, and I want to tell you about Phantom of the Paradise. Phantom of the Paradise. The film was a great disappointment commercially when it first opened. We had unusual numbers for Canada, and as it turned out, unusual for the world. Here was this movie that was failing everywhere, and in Winnipeg, it was topping the charts. Hard to believe on first hearing that Phantom had taken over the minds of an entire generation of Winnipeggers. Phantom of the Paradise is maybe the reason why I'll always plan to live and work in Winnipeg. Why us? Why Winnipeg? And there's so many theories of it. I fear it is simply the isolation. They were all fans of Phantom, and I was a little leery of it, to be honest. This was 30 years later. And they all came, the whole cast. We just got lucky, I guess. <laughs> The reason Phantom of the Paradise has survived can be handed to the Pagers and say, you know what, you gave life to this movie.